Hello everyone, today I want to talk about bicycles in the Netherlands. As you might know, it's a real cycling country and I always enjoyed it myself also. If you look at the stats, you know the Netherlands has about 17 million people, but more than 22 million bikes. So that's more bikes than people in the Netherlands. If I look at myself, you know, I'm used to cycling all my life, you know, I've been doing it since I was young. As a child, I was just enjoying it, having fun with it. And as I got older, I still used the bicycle for all kinds of uh, things, you know, going to work, going to study, uh, going anywhere to friends just by using the bicycle. And that's great, you know, there's a real great infrastructure in the cities for cycling, you know. But there is a dark side to bicycles in the Netherlands. And that is the theft. You know, the number, the scale of theft of bicycles is really a problem. And that's why I want to talk about why I do not use a fancy bicycle or an expensive bicycle. When I drive bicycle now, it's re it's really, it re looks really cheap. It looks old, you know, uh, it just looks like an old simple bicycle. Uh, that nobody really wants to have. So I remember when I was young, about 17, 18, you know, I started getting these really nice bicycles. So it started out with uh, a black mountain bike, which was really neat, really cool looking. It had a, right, extra thick tires, extra thick structure, and it just looked very cool, but also fun to, to cycle with. So that one got stolen uh, behind a church. Um, and you can imagine I, I have a very thick lock also. I had like a lock you can compare to the locks they use for motorcycles, really thick chain lock. So, but the, the chain lock was uh, broken and you know that was left, but the bicycle was gone. So after that, I bought another really cool bike, you know, that was even cooler. It has nice, it had nice blue, purple colors. And it had like spoilers, you know, like your spoilers on the car, but these were special spoilers for a bicycle. So that is possible, yes. And it was really looking really nice. And it also had these special carbon style tires, you know, the, the inside of the tire. It was not the metal, but it was like a thick carbon, which also looked really nice and was kind of unique. So again, you know, I had really like the thickest lock I could get for a bicycle. Uh, I locked it at the, at the station, metro station, and one point in time that was also gone. So, you know, this is really terrible if you have like your favorite bicycle and somebody just takes it away and it's gone. So, you know, right now I just take ugly old bicycles. Uh, they, they work well, you know, they, they work fine. It's really relaxing. Uh, you know, they drive very well but they don't look like anything you want to get. So that's the way I keep my bicycle safe now. And it's really a problem. Bicycle theft is really a large problem in the Netherlands. It happens a lot. And what also the thing is that I want to comment on is the culture around it. How many times I've heard in my life someone say, if you need a bicycle, just take one that you see on the streets. So people talk about stealing bicycles like it's something you can uh, do just like that. Something that is uh, harmless or some, something like that. So I really don't agree on that. You know, it's really a problem for a person. You know, it's really a problem if you steal someone's bicycle, you, you leave someone in trouble. Maybe that was his most important way of transport. You know, maybe you cannot afford getting a new one easily. You know, so it's really a, a bad thing to steal bicycles. And I really hope that something will change in the culture in the Netherlands that they don't uh, just laugh about it like that, but really acknowledge it for what it is, that it's really a problem and people shouldn't just steal someone else's bike. It's really just not fair. And you're really hurting someone financially, personally, you know, uh, in my case, it was also really I really liked that bike a lot and then you you cannot get the the same type either you know it's like uh, once in a life uh, time that you find a bike like that and then you have to go for another one again and also if you think about uh, like the, the the black mountain bike i had 
I really spent a lot of time updating it, improving it, making sure everything was working better, you know, adding new lights, uh, replacing parts. So, and after that, when it gets stolen, it's really bad. So uh, be careful when you are in the Netherlands and you have a bicycle, make sure you, you lock it up somewhere or you put it in a place where there is uh, a surveillance or something like that. And also, if you really don't want uh, your bike to get stolen, I really recommend also just take a really low key bike that uh, no re nobody really wants to have. That is not worth a lot if they would sell it somewhere else, you know, just an older and a bit ugly bike. I, I recommend that if you want to keep it for more long term. So that's it about cycling. Be careful with your bicycles, lock it up and uh, I hope you can keep yours. See you next time in the next video.